I've had a Leatherman tread for over a year and it's become one of my favorite tools. So I decided to get its smaller sibling, the Leatherman Tread LT. Let's talk about some of the similarities and also some of the differences of these two tools. Here's the box for the original tread. This is the one for the Tread LT. They're similar shape, but the Tread LT has more information on the back. The Tread LT comes with documentation that could work for any of the three models of the Tread. The Imperial, the Metric, and also the Tread LT. This documentation tells about the different links and which ones are available on which model. Both of the treads come with eight full links and one half link. For my wrist, I have to take out two full links. You'll notice that the original tread is larger than the Tread LT. The Tread LT is around 19% narrower and 7% lighter than the Tread. The Tread LT is nice if you want a little bit less bulk or a little sleeker design for a smaller wrist. You'll see a lot of crossover on the tools that are included with the different versions of the Leatherman Tread. But you'll see a couple tools on the Tread LT that were previously only available on the metric version, such as Posi Drive or Torx drivers. It seems that Leatherman did this so they wouldn't also have to have a metric version of the Tread LT. It comes down to personal preference which one you'd prefer to wear. I think I'm going to keep the stainless for daily use and the black one for more formal events. The wrist form factor almost begs a watch to be added to it, and that's what I'm going to do with some adapters from Leatherman Link. I'm going to use some of the 20 millimeter adapters for my watch, but they come in all different shapes and sizes for everything including Apple Watch. Let's take a look inside the box, have some documentation, then we have the two adapters, spring bar tool, and some extra spring bars. We'll start by connecting the adapters to the watch with the spring bars. With the adapters installed, I can now remove links to install it on the tread. For this watch, I need to remove two and a half links. Thanks to the watch adapters from Leatherman Link, I now have a watch installed on my Tread LT. It makes the Tread LT into the world's coolest and most functional watch band. So which one is your favorite, the original Tread or the Tread LT?